What is going on you guys? Steve with the video for you today. So today we're going to do a hobby talk video. But before we do that, I just want to give a quick channel shout out to the channel uh, Collecting Maddox. Alan over there on his channel. So he's got currently 131 subs. I'd like to push him over 150 if uh, possible. You know, he's been a massive supporter of my channel ever since we found each other. And in all honesty, I don't remember how we found each other. Some of this told me I might have seen him roaming around in the comment section of somebody else's uh, videos. And what I usually like to do is, you know, if I'm not familiar with the channel, you know, I see them in the comments. I'll say, hey, how's it going? Uh, you know, try to interact with them. Say, you know, I see you make content. I make content. Um, see if we can connect. You know, I try that every so often to see if I can find uh, new channels to connect with. So I think that's how I found him. But anyways, yeah, um, recently he just gave me a uh, amazing shout out on his channel. And, you know, he said a lot of a lot of positive things about my channel. I just want to thank him for that um, by giving him a, sh a channel shout out here. Again, link to his channel in my description. So what you'll see on his channel is uh, um, he's a, obviously a big Greg Maddox fan, unless he's talking about his brother Mike Maddox, which I don't know if I don't know if that's what he's doing. But uh, I, I know it's Greg Maddox, but yeah, I'm just messing around. Um, what I like, too, is he always says, uh, you know, He's trying to convince himself that he's an Atlanta Braves fan. You know, he talks about my Chicago Cubbies quite a bit. So yeah, you know, that's always fun to hear him say that. Uh, yeah, he is an Atlanta Braves fan. And one other thing I like about his channel is he shares a lot of pictures. Uh, when, he sh uh, when he shows his videos, it's just not like Maddox. It's other, you know, I know he's a big Steve Carlson fan. And... Uh, Bob Gibson, stuff like that. So, you know, that's kind of cool to see that kind of stuff. Um, so, yeah, I want to give him a channel shout out. And I also want to mention a couple other channels that, you know, mentioned me in their videos. Um, Max over at Mac Wax Stacks. Uh, he did, I think it's a new segment on his channel called The Hobby Desk. Not 100% sure on that name, but I think it's called The Hobby Desk. But, uh, yeah, you know, he mentioned my channel and that was pretty fun how he did it. Um, so I appreciate that. It said some really kind things. And uh, Drew over at Clean Cheap Shots. Also, he's been on YouTube for one year now, he said. Which, man, where does time go? That's just... This seems like he's been on there one year, but, uh, you know, both those channels are growing at a pretty good pace. So, you know, that's awesome to see. So now, kind of the big thing that I want to talk about on this is, you know, just kind of talk about my channel. Um how it's been going. I really don't talk about it a lot. So just kind of want to do that on this hobby talk. So currently I'm at 500 or 576 subs, I believe. And you know, subscribers is not everything. A lot of those uh, subscribers are just kind of dead channels or, you know, it's I uh, I don't know what you call them. You know, the people that say you need to do this or that to improve your, uh, both send you emails about how to make your channel more big and all that. And I don't care about that kind of stuff. I mean, is it nice that people watch my content? It is. I like that people can relate to, to me and my channel, but it's not everything seeing the, you know, seeing the subscriber counts. Uh, I feel like I've got a lot of loyal supporters on my channel, which that's you guys. I appreciate that. Um, like I said, I think my channel growth is a uh, turtle pace, but, oh, uh, I got, I had some people mention about, <laughs> they haven't seen the pug lately in videos. So yeah, she's back here, man. I got to put her on the bed now. She can't jump up there herself. She's just getting too, too old. I guess she's, I think she's about ready to turn 13. Uh, my wife and me got her as a wedding present to herself. So yeah, you know, she's hanging tough in there. Uh, sleeps a lot, but yeah, she's back in the videos. <laughs> it's funny. You guys, some of you guys asked about her. Um, you know, yeah, my channel just grows like, you know, turtle pace, which is fine. Um, you know, my, my views and likes, you know, I'm very thankful for that. Very thankful for everybody that watches too. Um, you know, it's, uh, I feel like my channel's come a long way from many years ago when I just sat there and you just, just used to watch videos and not even comment or anything. Uh, I feel like I'm kind of growing as not only a YouTuber, but as a collector and just looking, you know, I've, I think I found my groove really with my, uh, 
kind of where my three channel, you know, my three things go with the uh, hobby socks, the player spotlights, and then kind of my PC collection, which is kind of the heart and soul, uh, you know, what I um, consider my bread and butter in my collection. So yeah, you know, uh, it's been enjoying making content lately, and uh, especially the player spotlights. Really like doing those. That's been my favorite, honestly, lately. So I'm, you know, I'm gonna keep those coming. Uh, quite a bit, probably a little more than what I usually do. And let's see, I'm at the five minute mark. Just want to talk about a few more things. So in Omaha, there's a connecting city to the city of Omaha. And it's called Council Bluffs, Iowa. It's right on the Missouri River. You know, it's one side is Nebraska, Omaha, the other side is it's called Council Bluffs, Iowa. And Council Bluffs, Iowa is having a massive card show the week before the Nationals. And I know. I've actually talked to several YouTubers who said they're going to go to that show. And, you know, that's right in my backyard. So uh, I'm probably going to go two out of the three days that they're hosting the event. It's supposed to be huge from what I understand. It's somebody from Kansas City running the show. And, you know, I'm, I'm going to try to meet up with as many YouTubers as I can if you guys tell me that you're coming out. So, yeah, that's going to be kind of fun to interact and meet a few new people. Um Let's see, collecting wise. So I, I am looking forward to that. I think it's what do they say the week before the nationals? And um collecting wise, just picked up a Ryan Howard autograph and the 1992 Donner's update of uh rated rookie of Kenny Lofton. And that's a real tough card to find, actually. Um, that's crazy. I actually go on to eBay. There's more 1952 Tops Mickey Mantle rookie cards than there are that Kenny Lofton rated rookie card. Just crazy to, you know, something to think of. But I do want to wrap that up here. Please go check out Collecting Maddox. Um, Alan over there and a link to his channel in my description. Thank you to everybody who supports and, you know, comments and likes, watches. It means a lot. So thanks again, guys, and take care and stay safe.